look out she don't kick back. That was one hell of a fight right there. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the word. Timber! Timber! Keep going, baby. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Yep. Yeah. That's thunder and hills there. Little leaves. Yeah. <laughs> what a backside. Yeah. <laughs> My goodness. Hands have the whole center of that locust ate out. She hollow in the middle, Dave. Yeah, she's the one. She's wanting to go. There she goes. Here we go. Look at that. Saved that little whelm, Dave. Yeah. I said it might just brush it and leave it alone. Beautiful. Very nice. You know, I asked you, I said, is that thing hollow? Because when you was sawing, yeah. I could hear it echoing. Really? <laughs> yeah. Hey, yeah. still good firewood. Those black ants are hard on these, that's for sure. Oh, yeah, get them now or lose them. Yep. All right. We'll buck this up and uh, get it, what we do, a 12 foot, a little over 12 foot pieces? Yeah, about 12 3, and uh, that way you get a nice selection. All right. Here we go. got a hard leaner here of uh, what looks to be red um we're gonna do a plunge cut on it and uh, once we hit that trigger it ought to fall pretty quick
All right, glad to have that one down. As you can see, I'm up against a, about a 12 foot drop to the creek there, so I don't have a whole lot of room to run on that one. But it went exactly how we planned. So we're gonna go ahead and get the tractor with the winch, pulled off the stump, we got it cut pretty much clean off there. It's gonna make a lot of nice firewood. Get you back here with the winch, one second. Real quick, I wanted to show you all this huge poplar behind me. So this thing's probably, uh, well, close to five foot across at the base there. Maybe bigger. Here's the tractor coming, and I just noticed Big old hornet's nest. Tell you what, a lot of hard work in the firewood, but it sure is enjoyable. Let me know down in the comments if uh, you all have gotten your firewood ready for the winter. A lot of you, I'm sure, already have stages stockpiled and split in season, but with the outdoor boilers, it doesn't take quite the planning and effort there so um, we're getting at it here late fall we usually do this every year get us ready for that winter So we're going to try out our new England uh, quick release snatch block. If we were to keep pulling in the direction we were, we're going to lose it down the creek bank. So off to the base of this little hickory tree for a couple feet and uh, we should be good to pull right up there to where we're going to process them. She's gonna roll a little bit down the bank, but since we're wedged, it shouldn't go anywhere. Let's see. And there she goes. Beautiful. That's gonna be some good firewood there. Beautiful. Worked just as planned. Then we're gonna go ahead and probably just hook to these tops and do this one separate there. <laughs> 